put your hands together, let's bless the Lord. But let us speak your name. Tell your neighbor next to you, no matter what we're going through. Come on, say it like you mean it. Say, no matter what we're going through, we're going to make it. How many of you know that? Come on, give the Lord a clap. You know we're going to make it. Get praying for the people in Florida. We're going to make it. I mean, no, we give a God on our side. We're going to make it. Come on, give the Lord another hand.
know, see, if you don't keep the commandment, your children ain't gonna keep the commandment. See, if you don't live holy, your children ain't gonna live holy. Uh -huh. And the life, they gonna be what you teach them. You don't teach them nothing, they don't have nothing. Uh huh? Amen. Amen. I said, you don't teach them nothing, they don't have nothing. You are responsible when you teach your children about God. I know all the amen, all of you go to all of you, everywhere else. Get man knowledge, book knowledge, but you don't teach them how to fear God. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. Let me back on your life in the praise of God. Your seed shall be mighty among us. Yes. The generation of the upright shall be blessed. Yes. yes. Ain't no mind to this thing. The generation of the upright shall be blessed. Y'all yes. get that? Amen. God, you amen. I know you let the children have do they want to have what do what they want to do have their way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yes, make dumb. <laughs> but if you had to really talk to them the word of God, they probably have some money. Uh-huh. Amen. 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 Uh, you gotta put God first in their life. Amen. Uh-huh. Amen. Let me this what it said. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Praise God. He said, shall be mighty upon the earth. The generation of the upright shall be blessed. Yeah. Wealth and richness yeah. shall be in his house. Yeah. Wait a minute. Uh, now that's what the Bible said. Now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. I didn't say that. I said, if you teach your children, you might look like you teach them holy. You might be too strict on them. But the stripping you are on your children, and the more you make them keep you the man of God, in life, they're going to be blessed. Amen. 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 Come on, Mike. Amen. Huh? Amen. So that means you are responsible halfway that your children ain't got that. Come on, Bernice. Don't get mad at me. <laughs> you let me have that way. Amen. 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 That's what the Bible says. Amen. I'm going to go back over that again. Praise the Lord. Blessed is the man that feareth the Lord. Fear the Lord. And delight is friendly in his commandment. Yes. Yes. His seed shall be mighty upon earth. Amen. The generation of the upright shall be blessed. Amen. Wealth and richness shall be in his house. Uh -huh. It don't mean you're going to be a man there. But when you got everything you want, that's what you call wealth. Amen. Huh? Amen. Well, it don't mean now to be wealthy now. You can't say you got everything you want. <laughs> Amen. You'll be in the house. His righteousness is new step. So he's right up right in the righteousness of how you live and how you conduct yourself and how you choose what they're going to have in life. Oh, yeah. Amen. Amen. Yeah, amen. See, amen. 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 So yeah, amen. the Bible says, uh, in one prayer, it says, I know Abraham. Uh -huh. Or he will command his children to do right. Amen. That's what he said about Abraham. He said, Abraham, said, I know Abraham. And he will command his children to do right. Huh? Amen. That's what God said about Abraham. He commanded the children. So they never did it. When he said, command the children right, that means, do you know what? Abraham should have blessed. Oh, yes. Yeah, that kind of, kind of picked right on him. The Jews and the Arabs, amen. One got the oil, the other got the money. Mm -hmm. Smug, you know. 
I know we look at it another way, and I know you look at it and say, my Lord, amen, going to church, amen. That's what you, that's what your mom made you do. But you bless. The boy your mama had not made you go to church. Uh -huh. You would have done. The lady you had the altar, and the reason why you fled, you would lay that the altar. Uh -huh. And they prayed over you. Uh -huh. Oh, y'all go with me. Amen. Y'all know when your mama laying at that altar. <laughs> Put one on one side, the other on the other side, lay the hand on you, pray for you. Yeah. Amen. 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 Praise God. Amen. See, I know we look at it, amen, oh, we, man, we got more knowledge, we got more sense, you. That's good. You got more sense, but you ain't got more money. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Amen. amen. This is the way he says, Amen, praise God. Yeah. Unto the upright, there are a rise in the light in the darkness. Mm -hmm. To the upright, there rise in what? Light in the darkness. Yeah. Hey, you in dark days. Hey, man, you ain't got no dark days. Light be rising in the darkness. Praise God, you bless. Yeah. We're blessed, Amen. You know, he praise God. Amen. They say, well, amen. Well, they may you they got some smart kids. Maybe you have. Smart than one day and being blessed to know. Amen. <laughs> you don't know what I'm talking about. Amen. amen. You have all the green in the world hanging on the wall and not have a dime. Come on, but they well, you can't have God and not be blessed. Amen. That's all I'm trying to tell you. You can't have God and you can't keep the demand of God without having some wealth in your house. Amen. Some money in your house. Amen. That's all I'm trying to tell you. That's all I'm trying to say, praise God. Amen. You got God. Amen. So you have some money. Amen. Oh, you decide from the casino, take his bum off the street and bring him to church, amen. And then suddenly, suddenly he got a suit on and he breaks. Amen. 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 Isn't that good something, brother? Amen. Praise God. Amen. 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 Full of compassion and righteous. A good man shows faith. This is what they put. And lean. You got money, no money to lean. Y'all may not like this. Y'all may not like this. I'm just going to tell you the truth. A good man shows pay when you got enough money to lean. That means you got enough money. You can make money get off. Amen. You get some extra money for your lean. <laughs> He would guide his affair with the street. Hey, you know I'll take care of this. Take care of this. Yeah. Look how that might be. say, not only you have money, but you know how to. See, a lot of people have money. Amen. But they're lost. Amen. But in the Bible, he said, a good man going to know how to take care of his affair. Yeah. He's going to know how to keep his money. Yeah. So it's one thing to have money, but another thing to know how to keep money. Y'all know what I'm saying? Yeah, a lot of people know how to make, uh, 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 go and make work. That's what we're talking about. They ain't no house to keep the money. People had millions of dollars to go to the bank work. Right? If people had millions of dollars, they'd be able to go to the bank Like I was doing a little thing, they called it Ron Bone. Made millions of dollars. Had a train named that. Train named that. Amen. Died on the way. That's all I'm trying to tell you, amen. When you say good man, you know how to take care of money. Amen. 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 Y'all love the Lord. Y'all love it. Amen. 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 Praise God. You know how to take care of money. You know, one day they have money, you know how to take it. And I have 
the most of the value that was on the field, amen, they had to get off because they couldn't take care of the money. They went broke. They couldn't stay on that long. Or about two of them, they would stay on them because they could take care of the money. And all I'm trying to say is, amen, praise God, is he shall pay. And then, praise God, should he shall not be moved for him. He shall not be moved for him. Amen. That's good, ain't it? Amen. Don't even worry about going away. The separate reading of Isaiah, not be moving him, praise God. Amen. The righteous shall be, righteousness shall be in everlasting remembrance. Yeah, everlasting remembrance. He shall not be afraid of evil time. His heart is fixed. See, yeah. a lot of people go to jail, but there are a few people's heart is fixed. See, a lot of people said now, amen, praise God, the church died in front of this morning. Amen, thank God, what it is going to happen, I want to eat it. <laughs> you got to get stepped back somewhere, baby. Amen. <laughs> you got to get stepped back somewhere. Amen. You can't be so easy shaking and moving, man. Your heart has got to get fixed on something. To be blessed of the Lord, can you say that again? Amen. Amen. You can't be wishy-washy. If it don't go good, I'm gonna leave. Uh, well. uh, you gotta be fixed. Yeah. Your heart gotta be fixed. That way it said, praise God, amen. He shall not be afraid of evil time. His heart is fixed. Yeah. Trust in the Lord. Yeah. And all the people are trusting in the Lord. He knows. Uh -huh. Amen. They don't be shaking. They don't win. And doctor, they think I'm going by. What's that? Mm -hmm. You know what? You're going to learn how to pray. Amen. 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 Because you're going to learn how to say, I ain't going nowhere. I'm going to stay here. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Because if we ain't blow you one way, you're going to blow you another. Yeah. Some people just keep wishing, washing. Mm. They keep moving. They don't know where they stay. Backside was coming because your heart not fixed. Uh, 
Because yeah. you have to really decide in your heart what you're going to do and what you're going to be. Yeah. Are you listening? Yeah. You had to say praise God, amen. Amen. In regard to the situation, I'm going to stay with God. Yeah. See, some people stay with God because mama stay with God. Mm -hmm. Sisters stay with God. Their wives stay with God. Their husbands stay with God. But you got to stay with God because you, your heart is fixed. Huh? You stay with God because you know the Lord. Because you know the Lord. Praise God. And if you not, don't have that in your mind, you can leave it in there. Who ain't looking for you one Sunday you go? Huh? Somebody got this. If that said the Lord, you might take off with that said the Lord. A lot of people believe that somebody prophesied over. That said the Lord, the Lord told you, he tell you, you're supposed to be ready. Uh -huh. You don't go wrong for yourself. You're in a bad shape. Amen. 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 This is why I say your heart is big. Because simply you know God for yourself. Amen. You're not serving God for me. You're not serving God for your husband. You're not serving God for your wife. Your boyfriend or girlfriend. You're serving God for yourself. Amen. You see what I'm talking about? See, some people say if she stops her, it won't stop. He stops her, it won't stop. Mm. See, that was the one thing I made in my mind when I first started. If don't nobody serve God in my family with me, I'm going to serve. My wife don't serve, I'm going to serve. Amen. Mama don't serve, I'm going to serve. Dad don't serve, I'm still going to serve. Can you say, I don't care what you say? Hey, hey, you just, that was those things I put in my mind when I first started serving God. That my serving God would not be connected to mama, connected to daddy, connected to my loved ones, my children, it would be connected to what was in my heart. Your heart got to be fixed. Your heart has got to be fixed. You're not serving God for somebody else. And that's why he says, amen, his heart is fixed. Or you know what I'm saying? His heart is fixed. So that heart is fixed and, and righteous is for help. He is not God, no. You don't serve God. You don't serve, you're not serving God, amen, for what you can get out of God. You're not serving God for the money. You're not serving God. Are you listening to what I'm saying? Praise God for the fame. You're serving God because your heart has been fixed. Yes, yes, yes. If you're in your dime, you serve God. If you're blessed, you serve God. Amen. If you're poor, you're going to serve God. Amen. You don't have nothing, you're going to serve God. Amen. You're serving God because your heart is fixed. Serve God like that, like Job said. Praise God. He went to serve, he said, Lord, give it to the Lord, take it, bless it, be the name of the Lord. I'm going to keep on serving God. Amen. Keep on praising God. Keep on getting excited about what God is and what God can do. I mean, right with you. See, everybody, so many hey, April, you listen to what I'm saying? So many folks, hey, amen, they don't know who they serve. Uh -huh. And even Joshua said, make up in your mind who you're going to serve. Yes. Yes. Say, for me and my house, we're going to serve all. Yes. Now you make up in your mind who you're going to serve. Choose the thing, who you're going to serve. Yes. You need to, amen, choose who you're going to serve, who you're going to live for. You. And really, you need to choose whether you're going to live with the devil or live with God. Amen. 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 That's what I'm saying. Yeah, hey, man, you ain't live part time with God and part time with the devil. You know, this is why it wasn't going to happen. The trouble was, he said, the commandment of God, because the two men are part time Christians. Amen. Mm. And that is, we live with God part time. And live with the devil other part. Mm -hmm. So no man can sit take with the devil and say, take my Lord. Mm -hmm. You can't serve two masters at the same time. 
Not only have you got a 29, you got to say two masters. You can't say God and mamma too. Huh? So you're going to get love one and hate the other and love one and though. So you're going to make them in what side you're going to get on. It's going to say a fixed heart. You make them in your mind. What side you going to be on? What side are you on this morning? Whose side you on? You're straddling the fence? What will you do when you get out of here today? Who are you going to be serving Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Amen. Friday, Saturday? Yeah. Huh? Amen. 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 Yeah. They see, now, then you look at it and praise God. And we go back to the next trip. Because, see, you know why your children live a hypocrite life? Because you're a hypocrite. <laughs> <laughs> How you expect you know, just ain't that the person on the Sunday when you live and live like hell? No. Oh. 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 Huh? And that buddy is trying to exaggerate that, but let's, let's go back and look at it again. Praise the Lord. Blessed is the man that favored is the Lord. Uh -huh. yeah. And the light is great in his commandments. Yeah. See what I'm saying? Light and bread in his commandment. Well, where that man gonna live right? You live right at home? Now you take that look at it. You say, well, that's pretty good. Cool. You know, if you're not there, any man expecting your child to hold it, and you drink it, cuss it, talk about people, lie on folks, and expect them to talk about church folks, talk about the preacher, <coughs> to your children. <coughs>
What you do at home is what, hey man, you know, that's what's going to be instilled in that way. Home training is the only, the best training. Mm -hmm. That means the only training. Mm -hmm. What you teach your children. You start teaching me before they come in the world. Yeah. And you don't go down even go a baby boy and you start teaching. Mm -hmm. They they say you can talk to them in the womb and you start telling them. Teaching it. Actually, you right. get more training in the womb than you get outside. Amen. Amen. If you're alive, he will come in alive. Are you training? You actually train the child for the moment. You train the child to be what he is. Most of the teaching is taught. Y'all read what I'm talking about. Amen. 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 Maybe y'all didn't know that, though. <laughs> Maybe you trained. If you ain't to be just what you can be. Amen. Now, because of the Bible, holy parents want to have holy children. Amen. That's what the Bible said. Why? Because you're going to teach them holiness. Yeah. 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 Amen. Amen. Come on, Pop TJ. So you only finish training now they come into the world. That's true. Are uh, y'all with what I'm saying? You get a place I said, hey, praise God. Some of the things, amen, that people didn't get. God had to save them and deliver them so they could be there. Yeah. You no, know, I didn't come here, amen, and holding this. I didn't come in home. God delivered me. Amen. Can you say amen to me? Hey, I wasn't born in the Holy. I wasn't born in the Holy Church. I wasn't born in the Holy. I wasn't born in knowing the commandment of God. Amen. The Lord teach me the commandment of God. But that, but hey, man, I'm learning. I'm learning that the closer walk mom and daddy with the Lord, the more blessed you. That's true. Huh? Now the closer walk with this Bible. You are. Yeah. And how your children will be blessed. Now, if you get away from the word, the children get away. I read it again. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Blessed is the man that fed the Lord. Mm -hmm. Now, that man can sound the less head the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear God and keep it commanded. But this is the whole duty of a man. Amen. Amen. Now what keep you from drink? Fear. What keep you from medication? Fear. Huh? Come on now. What keep you from stealing? Fear. Fear. You see what I'm talking about? Amen. If you fear God, you mean you're not you don't really don't fear mom and dad that way. You can't fear God. You got the God fear on the inside of you. Hey, God fear that you go to hell. God fear that you when you won't go in here, that you miss the miss God. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. And so everybody said, here the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear God, keep his command, but this is the whole duty of a man. Because if you can fear God, you're gonna live right. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. If you don't fear God, you're gonna be him. Let me get a sense of what I say. Because you don't fear God, you would, amen, you would, 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 you you would, you would, you you would, you would, you would, you you see you would, you you would, 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 you 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 that's what I'm saying? That's what's going to keep you in check. It's God. Check me in God. You can just say check me because it's God. Amen. You don't want to talk about folks because you know God look at you. You ain't going to allow folks because you know God listen to you. See what I'm talking about? So he said, bread the man that fed the Lord. Didn't turn around and say, bread in the commandment. 
Your seed shall be mighty upon earth. You're going to pray for his sons and daughters, they're going to be mighty in the church. Holy me. Now you're going to bring up, you raised up, and all you got to do is just say, well, come on, I want to make him a trustee. I want to make him a deacon. You can already pray in public. Yeah. You're mighty name in the church. You're trained to be nothing, that's why you go with They had no fun in the way you want to be. He said, I'm going to be there. I want to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to give off. I'm going to be there. We good. We're going. You got around to the land. What are you going to be? Ain't going to be nothing. You're going to be nothing. Are you trying to be nothing? Come on. Come on. Come on. Amen. I'm not trying to be. I put my children into the limit. They had to be the best they could be in life. Right. Yeah. And the best wouldn't be good enough. You had to keep being the best. That's a praise of God. Yeah. Amen. Push them to the limit. Amen. Well, they made it or not, I push them to the limit. Yeah. Took it to the library and give a library and come. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone yeah. in the library. Yeah. 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 Everyone in my church had a library and come. And they tell them about that shooting hoop. I can't be the library. They had to go to the library. That's what they were doing. They were sitting out there playing ball now. They were at the gym, not my children at the library. Children don't fail. 
Why? Because you're going to put the fear of God in them. Huh? You know, amen, you may be too old to put it in that, but in love, you can put God to the bow and the switch. That's what it is. You get the bow and you get a switch. Bow and switch. Then you have a good book. So a lot of y'all sure ain't never had a good book. Can you say amen? Oh, Lord, what it all about? Can you say amen? Don't let nobody tell you that switch will work. Amen. Man. You can teach him all you want to do. You can teach him. You just go in on and just teach him. And they don't know it does. Put no pay in They don't get out of your front of you. Huh? Amen. Your children may not even be a friend of you because you don't get what they have. Damn, look. I had a, 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 a and then I, I, I told this poor boy to train the dog, train my dog, and train my dog. My dog, I trained him, and he do right and give him good work. Mm. I made him do right, right? The rest of people had their dogs, all of them had dogs, you would give them treats to make them act right. <laughs> <laughs> Every time they do something, they give them a piece of Y'all know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Then when the state, amen, the mission came by, amen, for the final text, amen, they couldn't give no candy. Uh -huh. The dog had to be on his own. Uh -huh. See, my dog, amen, knew what a whoop was about and what to do. <laughs> <laughs> he went around that way, man, state commission, amen, and said that, and he said, lay down that bow, and she didn't have to look at it. Yeah, and I walked all over the place and why you still ain't there with me. <laughs> the other one kept the cat and dog right there and he tell me when he was still standing with one baby when they left the dog part right behind. <laughs> 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 they only trained the wrong. <laughs> they only trained the wrong. They only trained the wrong. And then expect for them to you can train the child here. If, if, if you do, if you clean the house, we'll give you a dollar. Mm. Yeah. If you don't give a dollar, you don't clean the house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to give you a dollar, you clean the house, you shake it like I was saying. Come on, Mike. Learn how to 
teach you how to be honest. If we don't learn how to teach our children to be honest, we will not mind. Uh, and so we just teach them to have their way. Uh -huh. Y'all don't like that, do Let him have his way. Let him have his check. Let him stay out late if he wants to stay out. Do what he want to do in your house. Oh, y'all don't hate you. May not like this, and you may not, you may not be, somebody may not agree with this. Huh? But see, in our house, we had a certain time you had to be in our house. Last three. Huh? Very few times I ever had to worry about a meeting at that time. You know what I'm talking about? Because, hey, amen, you know, good training would, well, I've been doing this way, you would make children feel the Lord. You make them feel the Lord. Amen. Child don't feel you, he don't feel nobody. Amen. So true. You're going to walk up you and start cussing you. I don't got no mind that's going to cuss me right now. <laughs> I, I don't think so now. I don't think so. I feel kind of sorry for you now if you start cussing me. <laughs> I do. I don't, think, I, I don't think they would do it. Amen. 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 You bring a child up and you lie and treat you any kind of way. I don't think that's right. Amen. Do y'all think it's right? Amen. You train him up, amen. Feed him, clothe him, and then he's going to treat you any kind of way. Come and cuss you a lot. Choke the life out of him. No. They ain't no business, is it? Amen. That's why I'm not training a child the way he should go when he gets old. He won't depart from it. Train. Nobody goes away from training. Y'all understand that? When you train something, it stays with it. You, you, you'll never have to redo it again. It's always to it. Amen. I mean, praise God. You know, anything can be trained. You know how you praise God and have a dog be nice in the house. That dog's in the house. And I started getting up, amen, early, you know, two or three o'clock in the morning, two o'clock in the morning, four o'clock in the morning. Now that dog won't let me sleep, I bet. If I go to sleep at four o'clock, he wake me up. And I don't need a clock now. Dog <laughs> wake me up. Amen. So anything can be trained. Y'all hear what I'm talking about now? Anything can be trained. Can you say man? man? And I don't know what you know how you how you would know when four o'clock come in the morning. But you know it's like when four o'clock comes. And dog get up and start walking. Amen. Oh well, you know when four o'clock comes. Now I don't know how a dog would know four o'clock comes. <laughs> and we don't know when four o'clock comes. <laughs> and dog can have that way said if we don't know when 8 o'clock comes on Sunday morning. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that bothered me. The folks don't know when 8 o'clock comes and dog don't know when 4 o'clock comes in the morning. Won't let me sleep on 4 o'clock. And you can lay in the young man's feet and not be here at 8 o'clock. <laughs> That's the making the sense, do it. Huh? Right, right. Oh, they don't make good sense if they do a dog have more sense than four. Right. Enough to know what time you get up. Right? right? And we don't know what time to get in. Right. So we get in and out of up. That's because you don't have more time to go on you. Right? And one of us know if service started at 8 o'clock, that won't be your be 8 o'clock. What time you go to work? If you push that clock or whatever it is now, sign in at 7 o'clock, what time y'all be there? Come on, Tim. What time y'all be at? Then you lay it and you be there at 7 o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> and most of the good work is be there at 7 o'clock. I mean, six o'clock. Good work, good work. People that are going to be uh, an amen, an amen supervisor, they be 
most of the work went wrong this morning. Every one of y'all train your children. The children gonna do exactly what you want. You got here and eat. It's like nine. Well, your children be in nine. Now, let me ask you this question. What would have been just easy with you? You didn't have eight the way you could get now. Huh? Come on, I just never had to stop you meeting, didn't it? Yeah. It wasn't the law of amen that kept you and made you late this morning. <laughs> 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 now, the dumb dog got an upset to wake me, wake me up at 4 o'clock in the morning. See, you ain't got no clock going in your mind to get up at 8. You can't hear at 8. You got to talk to me. Praise God. Ain't no more. You don't need a wife to do what? God back. You know, you're going to be at work at a certain time. And more time, you know, on time. On time. How many late? Somebody, how many late wait? Bless. 
blessed. How many of you want to be blessed? Everybody want to be blessed, don't they? Amen. 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 Someday it's better to make you shout, to make you dance, to make you speak in tongues. And some men want to put the fear of God in. Amen. And that's why you need to be blessed. To be blessed. Every one of you need to be blessed, right? Amen. Amen. How many of you could just actually go to your job and sit down and get paid? They would get paid if you would sit. You get a check. Get a good day and just sit down. Yeah. <laughs> 
can't step to it. I can't even do one, so God. <laughs> I make a bet you can go to a place they call hell. Uh, and I make a bet you can hear it down from me here on earth. I mean, you want everything God has for you, honey. Right? You want everything, right? Then you got to give God your best. Don't make a bet you get everything God got for you, you've been having something. Y'all love the Lord? I mean, love the Lord this morning. Do you love Him? Amen. Thank God for you. 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 Let God bless you. Praise God. God really want to do what? Bless you. Let's stand out of faith. Does God want to send some blessing? I will work. Amen. Do you mean that? If you do enjoy it, you ought to hand me some walking. Amen. Because I, 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 amen. I mean, expect to see some changes. Amen. See you blessed. I've been working with you. Father God, we ask you to stretch your hands and touch and bless them and bless their name. God bless them to be a blessing to their children. Bless them to be a blessing to their neighborhood. Bless them so they'll be a blessing, Lord. In the name of Jesus, do it now, Lord. Now, Lord, we ask you to do it. In the name of Jesus. And we'll give you that glory, give you that praise. And thank you for it right now. Give the Lord a good old hand.